when I came into it at first, I knew that I had moments when I was communicating with others where I would get nervous or sometimes I would represent myself really well and sometimes I wouldn't. I wasn't consistent. And I also knew that some level of executive presence was commonly something that was seen as a need to move up in the organization. So a bit of it at first was check the box and a bit of it was wanting to be able to be confident in speaking and having that consistency. Going through the process, however, I'd say I really moved from, oh, you know, I wanna make sure I'm checking this box, this feels like it resonates to me, to huge transformations in the way that I was actually speaking, not just in presentations to leaders, but day to day, just with teams and how confident I came across when I was answering questions or commenting in a meeting. Right. So it really impacted a lot more than I thought it would. But I did start as check the box and, you know, some things that I think I could do a little bit better. (laughs) Really, I mean, the group is so develops this rapport with each other and supporting each other that it completely takes away. Do you still get nervous? Of course you do. You've got to practice the skills, but it it's really awesome to be able to do that with a small group and see people progress together and feel that support from the individuals around you. Uh, would I still be nervous even taking it again? Of course I would. I, I still get nerves when I speak. Uh, but I, I think that that group environment was actually really beneficial versus me being a little bit nervous about it at first. It gave me more permission. I feel like it's the wrong word because we don't need permission, but it felt like I had gotten more permission to own my voice and not try and be the leader I want to become, but understand that I am the leader. And it's about bringing my true self to those situations and becoming more comfortable doing that is actually what's allowing me to achieve the things that I want to achieve. So I'm not trying to be that person anymore, I'm bringing myself there. And I think that's one of the big differences. For this particular course, I think it has so much applicability regardless of where you are in your current position, whether you're trying to grow, maybe transition. It's, I would take this 10 times if I could. (laughs) 